All right, Coach Hinkle, huge win. You, know, you guys kind of beat Kent State up a little bit. It was a nice match. Uh, and you battled with Maryland, their top 10 team, and their top 15 team. So one and one, you're splitting with two top 25 teams. Give me your thoughts on the day. First off, Maryland, what do you think? You guys got some moral victories. You know, they took seven of the, of the 10 matches from you, but talk about the Maryland duel a little bit. Well, I mean, again, uh, I hate to have moral victories, but we, we, we lost a real close win at 41. They got a great team, a lot of tough kids. Uh, we did. We just gave a few away. We, we relaxed a little bit at the end. Uh, we had some good performances, but yet, you know, I think Logan Brown came back and, and you know, proved that he's right there. He closed the gap a lot with Taylor, and we all know how tough he is. Uh, Archuleta, I thought, had a real nice chance to, to you know, win against Crom, who was in the NCAA semifinals. So, you know, just got to keep getting better. We got to improve on it, and that's what I told him. You ain't got much time to sit and whine about it. We got to turn around and uh, come back and wrestle another tough program. You know, Nick Corp lost one. I think he thought it was going into overtime. So we just made some mental mistakes against Maryland, and it is it is a tough team, and it lets us see where we're at. But you know, I felt like uh, we re wrestled that. We could we can make some improvements. What do you say to Corp about that? Pay attention to ride time a little bit more, maybe? Pay attention when you get ridden out for a whole period. You gotta realize that. I mean, that's we're yelling at him, but you know, that's one of those things. It happens. You gotta have enough awareness. He's a fifth year senior. He should have known that. But uh, again, you gotta learn from it. It's all about building up to the postseason. So, you know, and then he certainly had a tough, tough match with Kent State. But I mean, I thought our guys bounced back well. Again, Kent's had a great year. They pounded some great programs. And I told them, I mean, they come out, they're physical. They're aggressive, and uh, we got to step up to the challenge. And I felt like we did pretty much. There were some rough, rough, tough matches there, but uh, I was proud of our guys. We had a little, little uh, you know, kid at 57 really took it to Salazar. I'd like to have that match back, but uh, you know, overall, I think that was a nice comeback after losing a, a tough one to Maryland. 125 pounds. You're getting some real production. Two major decisions on the day. Where's this guy coming from? Out of nowhere, man. Yeah, he, he's a tough kid, and we got a tough kid in there, Matt Fields, who's had a lot of wins this year. But we decided to wrestle Cash this year. He was third in the Indiana State Tournament last year. We, uh, we've known him since he was little. feel like he's got a lot of upside. He was a match away from placing at Midlands. He gave the Garnett kid a run for his money first round. So we're real excited. The way he wrestles, the way he can score, his attitude, and he just doesn't wrestle like a freshman. And again, he's a kid that didn't even win the, the state tournament last year in Indiana. All right, is there anything else you want the people out there to know about what's going on in, uh, in uh, Purdue? No, we're just working hard. we got a good group of guys. We're trying to make sure we get the job done on the mat, in the classroom, in the community. We almost had a 3.0 this last semester, which is by far the high, you know, 296 with our guys. So we're trying to do it across the board, and, and uh, we want people on board that, that have that uh, type of mentality and those type of goals. we got eight guys that we signed early, so we're just excited about the direction of the program. All right, well, I know you guys got a duel coming up with Ash, and I'll let you get over there. Coach, thanks for the time, and good luck. Thank you.